your face To hear your voice And know to touch you Is a dream come true So I'm standing here With my hand held out Knowing that your love will never fade I stand amazed without a doubt And I want to hear your voice in the morning when I rise I think I know I'm just a normal man Only made of sand, except when you're by my side Will you love me, teach me, don't leave me, I pray And when I end up thinking of the times Your hands and mine together will stay You made me better today Than I was before And now my heart can rest And I will search no more You made me better today Day Today My heart has wings Oh, you take me away And every prayer I've ever prayed was answered today. <laughs> so I'm standing here with my hand held out, knowing that my love will never leave. My heart's on my sleeve, and now I believe. And I wanna hear your voice in the morning when I rise. I think I know I'm just a normal man Only made of sand Except when you're by my side Will you love me, teach me, don't leave me, I pray And when I end up thinking of the times Your hands and mine together will stay You made me better today Than I was before And now my And I will search no more Cause you made me better today I stand, proclaim True love is here to stay I stand, proclaim Forever starts today Today You made me better today than I was before, and now my heart can rest, and I will search no more. You made me better today. Yeah, oh, boy, yeah. Ala sota bal, 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 
Five can do small, no, little. Size, no, no, no. So this size five. Shoes. When I call, it's size five. I'm 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 size five. I'm
Do you know when to start again? Kala sa sila kala. It's here actually. But you want it on right now? Should we put it on though? Should we? Yeah, why not? Yeah. Should we? Yeah, why not? Yeah. Is this your own? Is this your own? Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, you can do it. Yeah. You can do it. Yeah. You'll spread it across your head and everything. Then make sure until it's built into my little bohalan diet. Okay. So try to flip it flat on the top of her head. So do they have two layer, right? No, just no, one. Just one, one layer. Okay. Yeah, that's one. Okay. There you go. Yeah, that part. I was wondering if you could get like the start. Uh, so we're good. <laughs> if, you go, if you start to cry, tip your head back, please, and grab a tissue. Okay. okay. I think so. My eye getting too. A little bit. <laughs> Starting to go. Um, that's it? <laughs> it's getting real, that's why. Alright, walk down the aisle. No, no, no. I think she's going to change. I that. think she's going to do her hair real quick. Look at her phone! Oh, that's my last bridesmaid. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So I think Titi's is next. She's she gonna do Kaya as well. Yep. Um, and then okay. I'm so bad at the bridesmaids. I just. <laughs> But by Bob, do you mean just start curling it all under? Or like in and like feathering No, I've never done that. Oh, so they last one it's not a garden, uh, what is the Oh, I see. Okay. So I thought we were going to do the photo to Oh, good now. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. 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 But I'm just a cook a dog and I'll buy a thing in here. Yeah, that's the good lemon and lunch. But I'm just saying, I'm going to do this one. You stay here, you stay here. Rose, you Did they say they're going to have someone there? Yeah, I don't know. No one's there. I don't know. Yeah.
Just congratulations and enjoy the day and good luck in the rest of your lives. Congratulations, guys. Love you. She's beautiful. Honestly, really inspiring. I remember growing up and she would take me and my little sister to the movies and ice cream and I just really wanted to be like her when I grew up. So being here on her special day as a bridesmaid means a lot to me and I really hope that an uh, amazing marriage and a happy future for you. Congratulations, BFF. The day has come. We're here. We're doing it. We love you so much. We're so happy for you and Aaron. <laughs> I wish you all the best. I hope you guys have kids and have a long life together. And, oh, and uh, why not? Let me just kiss. Good job, kid. You guys all good? You guys are good. Mahadev, you are good. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm a good hire. I hope you have a good wedding. Yeah. Oh, that's it. Hi. 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 Have fun today, relax, and if this is in the future, hi. I'm excited to marry you. Um, I can't wait for us to start our family. And I love you very much. And I can't wait to see you. I can't wait to start forever with you as well. Thank you. Uh, I got a chance. Uh, married in there. Welcome, Gaucha. Ya Babu ne Sara Gaucha the Nachu. Didin welcome Gaucha. Ya Ram ne Sara Er the Nachu. Now we let you to go to the Nachu. My name is Brahano. I'm coming from Chicago. Happy and happy wedding. Uh, 
ሰርጋቹ የሳራ ያብራሃም እንጆል እንመኝላቸው አለ ዘገብ እንትራችን ሰርጋችን ይደስታ የፍቅር ግን እንጆል እንመኛለን
Please stand. This is the day the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and give thanks. A picture perfect day for a wedding. Okay, it's a little chilly out, but you know, this is May in Minnesota. I still think you guys lucked out. Oh, by the way, as you probably know, Maylee Mahalik and Aaron have known each other, been together for how many years now? <laughs> Two years. I think it's about time they're getting married, don't you? Yeah! <laughs> we are gathered here in the presence of God and this community to join in Holy Marriage Mahalik and Aaron, and to bear witness to the transforming power of love. 
Love is a quality of spirit and an attitude of the emotions. But marriage is a life's work, a spiritual art form. Therefore, this is an occasion of both profound joy and great responsibility. And we who partake in it find ourselves as witnesses to the labor of love that Mahalat and Aaron are undertaking here. In acknowledgement of this holy purpose and of the power of this occasion, let us pray. Bless their marriage, O God, as they begin their journey down the road of life together. We don't know what lies ahead on the road, turns and bends, but help them to make the best of whatever comes their way. Help them to continue to enjoy each other as they did when they first met. Help them to realize that nothing nor no one is perfect and to look for the good in all things and all people, including themselves. Help them to respect each other's likes and dislikes opinions and beliefs, hopes and dreams, and fears, even though they may not always understand them. Help them to learn from each other and to help each other to grow mentally, emotionally, and spiritually. Help them to realize that no matter what happens to them, that they will hold on to each other and know that things have a way of working out for the good. Help them to create for their children a peaceful, stable home of love as a foundation on which they can build their lives. But most of all, dear God, help them to keep lit the torch of love that they now share, that they, by their loving example, they may pass on the light of love to their children and to their children's children forever. Amen. And the couple of children are reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. <laughs> Jesus said, Have you not read that from the beginning the Creator made the male and female and said, For this reason, a man shall leave his father and mother and be joined to his wife, and the two shall become one flesh. So they are no longer two, but one flesh. Therefore, what God has joined together, let no one separate. Uh, it's customary at this point in the wedding ceremony to offer some words about the nature of marriage. I'd like to give couples choices about the kind of ceremony they want. I gave Muhammad and Aaron three options at this point. Option A is a short five-minute homily on marriage. Option B is a medium-length homily on marriage. <coughs> and option C, you got it, a long, 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 long sermon on marriage. Which one did you guys want? The short one. The short one. <laughs> Life is a journey we need not travel alone. Rather, life is a journey to be lived in the community of family and friends. We are here to witness and to celebrate the beginning of Mahalat and Aaron's life together in marriage. A unique social and spiritual community of two people formally recognizing their bond of love for each other. To speak of marriage in a spiritual Christian manner is to view marriage in a way slightly different than usual. For when we speak of marriage in spiritual terms, we are inviting ourselves into it and, in, and it into us at a much deeper level. A Christian marriage is not just a state of being which will bring us happiness, but it is also a spiritual crucible of transformation, of suffering, and also of great joy. Remember as you both step into Christian marriage that it will be a process of spiritual transformation. You will change most remarkably 
and not necessarily in the way you have imagined. Or Christian marriage is a spiritual grinding stone which will hone you to your brightest beauty and brilliance. You will be reformed for in choosing each other. You have chosen to accept each other's journey in life and to be affected by each other's love. You will be polished through the actions of your beloved upon you. Through the praise, the criticism, the frustration, excitement, actions, and inactions. More than you can possibly imagine, you are drawn to each other precisely because that person possesses the attributes you need in order to change. These are the very qualities which, because of their capacity to inspire you and also to irritate you, will encourage you in every dimension you lack. And as you gift each other and acquire them, they will represent an enlargement of your soul. In Christian marriage, these dimensions are called virtues. Whatever virtue that is missing in your Christian life will gradually be developed in your marriage. And what's remarkable about this transformation to be more Christ-like is that in the end, rather than feeling bitter, resentful, or unwilling, you will come to see the acquisition of these virtues and deep Christian love as an exquisite refinement of your spirit. These spiritual processes deal with the deepest essence of your being and your capacity to love. You will learn to be kinder, to be empathetic, to be more trusting, to pray with one another. Whenever you are bound by your own emotional and spiritual limitations, whenever you have judgment or cannot come into the presence of your own generosity or forgiveness because of your woundedness, you will be challenged by your Christian commitment. You will be met in the character of your beloved with an invitation to transcend your own limitations, your judgment, your stinginess, your lack of trust, your fear of intimacy, your pride, your self-focus, your self-righteousness, whatever you are lacking, and to strive for their beautiful opposite. <coughs> marriage, even a Christian marriage, is not always a better religion. There will be unpredictable changes in your journey through life. But to know that marriage has a high spiritual purpose is to be willing to bear the sufferings and the challenges that lie on the journey ahead. To be transformed in Christian marriage is also to deliver yourself with joy. And thus, in the spirit of joy, we welcome Muhammad and Aaron to the spiritual undertaking that is marriage. Long may it stand as the cathedral of your love. Aaron and Mahale, now that you have heard about the magic and the mystery of the marriage, the way it will continually surprise you, the strength and wisdom that will everlasting <coughs> way out of you, do you choose still and happily and in our midst to make the promises of marriage? We do. We do. Did everybody hear that? Yep. We do. We do. Do you, Aaron, want to marry Mahali, to happily hold her above all and have her as your bride and wife? I do. Do you, Mahali, want to marry Aaron, to happily hold him above all and have him as your groom and husband? I do. Please turn, face each other, join all four hands. Look deep into each other's eyes and don't be nervous. Aaron, do you take Mahali for your lawful wife to have and to hold from this day forward, for better or for worse, for richer or for poorer, in sickness and in health, until death do you part? I do. Mahali, do you take Aaron for your lawful wedded husband to have and to hold from this day forward, for better or for worse, for richer or for poorer, in sickness and in health, until death do you part. I do. May I have the ring?
Lord, Lord, bless and consecrate Aaron and Mahali in their love for each other. May they bring be a symbol of true faith in each other and always remind them of their love. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Mahale, take this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity. As a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. In the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. <coughs> Aaron, take this ring. Aaron, take this ring. As a sign of my love and fidelity. As a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. In the, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. The couple has chosen a blessing with which all of you are invited to say amen. amen. I, will be, I will be holding my hands above them, and when it's your turn to say amen, I'll just lower my hand. It will happen four times. May Almighty God, with his word of blessing, unite your hearts in the never-ending never bond of pure love. May your children bring you happiness, and may your generous love for them be returned to you many times over. Amen. May the peace of Christ live always in your hearts and in your home. May you have true friends to stand by you, both in joy and in sorrow. May you be ready and willing to help and comfort all who come to you in need. And may the blessings promised to the compassionate be yours in abundance. Amen. May the Lord bless you with many happy years together so that you may enjoy the rewards of a good life. And after you have served him royally in this kingdom on earth, he may welcome you to his eternal kingdom in heaven. Amen. May Almighty God bless you, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you very much. Newlyweds, please seal your vows with a kiss. Yeah. <laughs> Honor guest, I introduce Mr. and Mrs. Sarina.
I found the love for me. Darling, just dive right in. Follow my lead. Well, I found a girl, beautiful and sweet. Well, I never knew you were the someone waiting for me. 'Cause we were just kids when we fell in love, not knowing what it was. I will not give.
talk to you, say a few things, girl I'm feeling you, but it's up to you, say you know what I do, I love you, 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 there's nothing above you, there's nothing above you, above you, above you, Bridge to you, I like your minis get to you, okay you can't refess you, if I tell you say I love you, oh, my money, my body, now your own, oh baby. 30 billion for the account, yo. Yeah. Versace and Gucci for your body, yo, oh, baby. No do, no do, no do, gotta, gotta for me. No do, no do, no do, say that, that, oh.
know to a part Never start saving money Everything is different Since you've been around It's a way of smiling eyes It's a way of crying It's a way I've watched you change
Cha-cha. 
back now, y'all. Cha cha again. Take it back, take it back now, y'all. Four hops this time. Right foot now. Left foot now. Cha cha now, y'all. Cha cha again. Cha cha again. Turn it out. Take it back now, y'all. Right foot, let's go. Take it, take, take it back now, y'all. Four hops this time. Right foot now. Left foot now. Cha cha now, y'all. Cha cha again. Cha cha again. Here we go, shoulders. Uh -huh.
the cake cutting ceremony. I'm proud of you guys. Get some water.